Five games this weekend and the storylines start to get a little better. The Bandits and Swarm kick things off Friday, 7.30 Eastern. Buffalo looking to make it a perfect 4-0 on the season. Matt Vince has been lights out, leading the way for all net miners with three wins, an 8.61 save percentage, a 7.67 goals against average. And Josh Byrne and Chase Fraser, they're going to look to keep up their hot hands, each with four goals last weekend against The Rock. Next, Seals rush Friday, 8.30 Eastern. Since dropping their first game of the season to the Warriors, the Seals are on a three-game win streak. Dane Doby leads the league with 16 goals and is third in NLL points with 25. Trey LeClaire, Mack O'Keefe, they lead the rookie scoring race with 16 and 12 points respectively. On the other hand, after being given the best odds to win the NLL Cup, the Rush have gotten off to a 1-3 start and last week mustered a mere five goals against the Firewolves, the second lowest goal total of this young season. The Firewolves will take on the Wings for the first time this season, game time 12 Eastern on Saturday before the Thunderbirds hit the road for the first time to take on the Toronto Rock, who are 500 on the year but a perfect 2-0 at home. The Thunderbirds, who are undefeated after two games in Halifax, will be playing their first game in 36 days when the ball drops at 7 p.m. Eastern on Saturday. It'll also be their last game for two weeks as the team's game the following weekend against the Bandits has been postponed. All signs point towards team captain Cody Jamison making his season debut, though he will be a game time decision. If removed from the COVID protocol list, Rock veteran Dan Dawson will be playing his 300th career NLL game. Finally, one will be winless no more. 0-4 Panther City looking for the organization's first ever win as they take on the 0-3 New York Riptide in Uniondale on Saturday. Enjoy week seven.